Alright, in this section we're going to look at family of solution curves. Now graphically, a general solution of a differential equation is the equation of any member of a family of curves. Its particular solution is the equation of one particular member of that family. The curve of one particular solution is known as a solution curve. Now, uh, to demonstrate what we mean by family of solution curves, let's look at the first uh, simple example in example 9. Now, in example 9, you are given a differential equation of this form, dy dx equals to 1, and then you are asked to sketch a family of solution curves by finding the general solution. Okay, so from dy dx equals to 1, uh, you can certainly reduce it into this integral form and then solving this simple integral form you would actually have y equals to x plus c now the general solution as you all know it okay will always okay bear uh, uh, with this uh, arbitrary constant c now the fact that the arbitrary constant c is within the equation this is uh, the reason that you could actually get a family of solution curves by giving c different different values in fact there are infinitely many values that c could take all right so that it gives you the family of curve now for examination purposes in terms of presentation of answer you are actually required to only give a minimum of three curves all right so usually usually we will give you uh, we will ask you to write out the solution curve for a particular value of c which is perhaps less than 0 bigger than 0 and equals to 0 so we need you to actually give a minimum of 3 curves alright so in this example we have chosen uh, 3 values c equals to negative 1 c equals to 1 and of course c equals to 0 so with those values of c alright it is easy to see that one solution of curve is y equals to x minus 1 Another one is uh, y equals to x plus 1 and of course the third one when c equals to 0 gives you y equals to x. So these are the three solution curves that you should draw for this particular uh, solution of the DE dy dx equals to 1. Alright, in example 10, you are asked to find the general solution of a given DE and then the DE is given as dy dx equals to y plus 1 and then you are asked to sketch its family of solution curves so in order for you to sketch uh, the first thing that you need to do is solve the DE now based on this particular DE you know that you need to actually apply variable separable right so you're gonna take um, all the y variables on one side and then the x variable on the right hand side okay and then you put the integral sign Alright, so solving this, you will actually have the modulus of y plus 1 ln, alright, is equals to x plus c. Alright, now with this, um, you will have modulus of y plus 1 equals to e x times e power c. And like what we have done before, e power c, we can actually rewrite it in terms of uh, another variable. Alright, so you could actually write it as a uh, y plus 1. Alright, equals to perhaps uh, b ex. Alright, now when you remove the modulus, okay, you know that you're going to get y plus 1 equals to plus minus b ex. Alright, uh, you are actually quite familiar with this. But finally, your general solution that you should get is actually y equals to uh, plus minus b ex. Alright, minus 1. Now, um, this constant here, plus minus b, you could actually rewrite it as another, ver uh, an, I'm sorry, another constant, maybe we call it uh, a, alright? So that is why the general solution for this particular de is actually y equals to a e of x minus 1, alright? Now, uh, for the family of solution curves, okay, like we said before in example 9, alright, you need to sketch a minimum of three curves. Okay, so the three uh, set of values is actually for a less than zero, a bigger than zero, and a equals to zero. So uh, for the for the sketches of uh, the these different values of uh, a, we actually use the GC to sketch. All right. If you don't want to use the GC for an exponential graph like this, it is actually uh, quite easy to sketch it by uh, manually. All right. So for this for these three different values, all right. So we are able to actually sketch the three, uh, three graphs okay, that depict the 
family of solution curves for this particular solution of the differential equation. Alright, now uh, how do you sketch the three graphs together at the same time using your GC? Alright, so please take note of how the syntax of the GC is being uh, done. Alright, we actually use this curly curve to denote alright uh, the different values of a. Alright, okay, as the coefficient of the exponential graph e power of x. Okay, so when you want to present the particular family of curves, alright, uh, as a as a form of presentation, alright, what you need to do is you need to actually sketch. Alright, the graph as so, and then you label a equals to one for the first uh, solution curve, a equals to zero, and so on, a equals to negative one. Alright, and all other properties of drawing of a curves, you need to actually uh, make sure uh, the the all the necessary things that you need to actually present in terms of drawing a or drawing of curves need to be there. For example, if there's a horizontal asymptote, you need to write down the horizontal asymptote. If there are any intercepts, you need to write down the what are the intercepts.